pour a glass of craft beer, we can do this. Yeah. Hey guys, we're back here in uh, Beverage Warehouse with Jason, and uh, what a store, mate. It's always uh, overwhelming. Oh, thank you, yeah this, in yeah. this is one of our three Vermont beer sections uh, where we highlight a mix of uh, breweries that made the jump from delivering by themselves a few cases at a time to those breweries that are now statewide and sign up with a larger distributor. Right. So we have people here like, you know, um, Frost delivers them by themselves, Ben Hill still delivers by themselves, uh, Stone Corral made made the, the jump um, to a distributor uh, recently, and they kind of grew here. And what we really like about this section is that it's, it's almost like an incubator for a lot of Vermont beer. Right. Because we will always highlight, promote, and, and, and be an advocate for every drop of Vermont beer that we can get in our store. And so a lot of times you'll, you'll see something kind of small on our shelves for a while, and then you can just see it grow and grow and grow. And it's, it's pretty neat to um, see breweries through all, all those phases um, in, the, in this section in particular. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. um, so some of these were, are very familiar because you brought them around last night, and mm -hmm. you got that, the pieces of eight, which I realized afterwards that about three other people had told us about. Oh, so it's, it's a that. fantastic beer. Yeah, That was a great sure. one. You got the, King, the Queen City. Yep. The Frost. Yeah. Um, yeah. Across the idle time, you had the Stone Corral, Queen City, yep. yeah, Queen City. That, yeah. um, uh, Berlin to Beer Company uh, bottles. That the, yes. that section for Berlin to Beer Company definitely expands and contracts. Of course, um, idle time from your friends over there in Stowe. Fantastic, uh, Stone Corral down in Richmond. The uh, the, the Hill Farmstead, uh, McKellar the grassroots in the in the Hill Farmstead and McKellar collaboration. There, we have a couple of their other ones that in is stock. Phenomenal, uh, Ryan from Casita Service Area. Uh, is brewing at Hill Farmstead. That's uh, his beers. He has, does a number of like flavored or tart ales. Okay. Um, Vasily from Wunderkammer. Oh, um, that was the guy um, that to come was today. Yes. supposed to you know be here today. Um, Simple Roots. Um, they're in. Um, they just moved. They're still self distribute, but uh, they just moved from their garage to an actual brick and mortar location. Cool. Uh, brought down the Simple Roots uh, saison there. Um, and we have some oh, other yeah. ones that are regionally available. You know. Long, Long Trail, Trail is still you know, an important you know, part of Vermont history. They're making new beers. They're doing like citrus IPAs and things right now and in 12 packs and 6 packs and bottles, and those are really good. Amazing. Switchback, um, some seasonal stuff from Magic Hat. We actually just some, had that feast. Of some things from uh, North Shire down in, in um, Bennington. Okay. Um, some Rock Art Bombers over there, some Harpoon, and some uh, Hogback from uh, Kevin. He's also self-distributing, and he's a... You know, like a one and a half man operation. So you know. a little bit of everything. Really. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's really, it's really, really uh, overwhelming. I even saw heard some other people say like, oh, and this is just one know, of man. the sections. Yeah, I mean, we've got like th two other sections that <laughs> are around. And even like the fridges as well that have uh, yep. got a bunch of the ones you were talking about. I saw the hermit thrush in there. Yep. Um, mm -hmm. There was even the Lawson's the session, the session version. Yep. Of the yep. Super sunshine. session number two. Yep. Um, I'm seeing rock out there. Uh, Burlington Beer Company. This is a lot. You just dropping names now. Yeah, no, it's oh. it's, it's, it's <laughs> an embarrassment of uh, riches up here. I <laughs> it mean, really it really is. it is really is a wonderland up here. I mean, it's it'd be hard to move to a, a place like Arkansas or something. <laughs> I mean, sorry, Arkansas, but uh, sorry, it'd be guys. hard to move. move. Sorry, <laughs> not sorry. Uh, <laughs> but I mean, it really is a, a wonderful time and place to be in, in uh, Vermont. Absolutely. Cool. I want you to show the camera if you may your uh, shirt. Yes. Oh, yeah, I got the... So you got the double the shirt. The Le Musketeer. I didn't even see that. Uh, Station host there. Yeah, yeah. Repping heavy. And Absol then the... Uh, Absolument. <laughs> why, why, so, so. Uh, I love that you're repping. And right behind this, I'm not sure if you can see that in the camera there, we got the Quebec section. The Quebec section. One of my, one of my favorite beer sections. Yeah. I know that the staff busts me about. Which, I, which I, of course, they do. And I do like that you got the Collective Arts. Shouts to Dan from Collective Arts as well. Mm -hmm. um, repping Ontario up in there. Yep. Um, didn't know they had Distro down here, but he did mention something that they come to... He has a gallery in Stowe. A oh. gallery meaning... Like, oh, like, like an art gallery in really? Stowe, nice. yeah. And so he has, he has a location in Stowe. He's not brewing in Stowe, but there's a... Connection. A, a very much a uh, Vermont connection to, Very uh, cool. to collective arts. Yeah, for sure. I think it's really cool. It's great for uh, great for beer for both countries to be expanding between us. Just unfortunately, it's not as much the other side of the border than it is us coming down here due to ridiculous laws. I, but, I, uh, yeah, well, I, I still... There's a lot of Quebec beer that I wish I could get my hands on down here, yeah. too. I mean, you know... I'm, a lot of the special releases from, you know, Dunham and, you know, but things have to go through so many different channels before they make it up here, yeah. you know. So. Well, at least you have your ways. Yeah. I was thinking about that last night. Like, I was like, yeah, I can hook someone up finally. Yeah. And I can go. <laughs> you can hook me up. <laughs> you can hook me up. Which yeah. is incredible. 
Is there anything else we need to know about the store? Or I guess all the different sections we were going through before, just trying to study our uh, purchase list mm -hmm. and see, which is uh, already a stressful task. Every time we come here, it's always like, oh my god, what are we even start yeah. with this? Well, this is an interesting mm -hmm. aisle because it's a mix of some, you know, really old school, you know, like uh, English and um, you know German um, styles behind us here. Um, in addition to you know like new American styles coming out here too. I mean, there's a lot of you know innovation happening in the uh, in the beer market, yeah. and uh, this aisle is is full of that. Still I mean, in the, yeah. and even um, you know like um, breweries like you know single cup you know what they're doing in, in New York I mean this is a phenomenal you know IPA and and people search for some of these brews that are um, from different states as highly as much as they search for some certain things from Vermont right mm -hmm. so it's uh, like I guess you do have a, a very solid representation of uh, most of the country yep yeah um, yep in every styles you know whether it's you know, new emerging styles or old school styles you know we get everything from the the beer geek that is looking for the most technical, perfect, like, you know, English bitter ale, you know, yeah. from England to just somebody that's looking for something crazy and extreme. Right. You know, there's a there's a wide spectrum of drinkers out there for, you know, whatever reason. And uh, we look to make everybody's lives more delicious. <laughs> yeah. And that you do. Yes. Uh, and that you do well. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just happy to be here, so I think we need to go and uh, do some shopping. Get our baskets yeah. ready. So, yeah. where can we find you guys online? I know we found out you out last night. BeverageWarehouseVT.com. And, uh, and it's at BeverageWarehouseVT on most social media, I believe. At least uh, yeah, pretty much, yeah. 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 And then we also, the way our, our website is evolving, where it's going to be more of like a, a live blog thing about like what's coming in or what's happening That's in cool, the beer yeah. world than just like a static. You know, um, website. website. For instance, when people are trying to get some of these beers, like Lawson's, for instance, you can click on the page for that Friday and Saturday that Lawson's will be delivered, and that post will change from "truck not here yet" to "Lawson's oh. is in stock" to "out of stock." Like so, real you can see yeah, right real time updates yeah. with some of these beers too. So, so yeah. uh, because I mean, everybody's using their you know smartphones and devices, for, you know, to to buy beer and to keep on top of things. So. So that's perfect. That's how we so, actually yeah. found out about the Heady Times here and also mm -hmm. the Lawson's. So check out the website. Uh, you don't have personal Instagram. Someone did post on my post last night, and so they hashtag Hi Jason. So I'm not oh, sure okay. If it was like a friend of yours, yeah. or maybe you have some lady fans. Someone, <laughs> someone, te yeah, someone texted me that this morning. They, they okay. sent me the picture. Like, Saw you're you, on Instagram yeah. now. <laughs> yeah, it's um, uh, so lipstick and lager. That's the one. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. She was up here. Uh, and then she moved down to Boston. So, right. so cool. she saw what you guys were doing. And, <laughs> and, uh, Popular guy. She knew right? I wasn't on Instagram, yeah. so she sent me a mail. No, cool. so, so yeah. you I love that. And the hashtag. Yeah. So, uh, man, really appreciate your Thanks time you once again. Yeah. Yesterday, yeah. Right. today. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Legend. Thanks, uh, make sure to review, uh, review and rate the podcast. Subscribe on iTunes. Subscribe on YouTube and follow us at the AOS Podcast on all social media. And uh, make sure to check out Beverage Warehouse VT everywhere and get your asses down here seriously because... Yeah. It's uh, VT. VT. Yeah. Yeah. Represent 802. Is it 802? Yeah. 802. 802. 802. 802. 802. Yeah. All right, y'all. Thanks, guys. Peace. Peace.